All right, guys, Jack Squat Digger here on the 3rd of October, 2010. It's a cool fall day. Finally got uh, fall here in Indiana. The leaves starting to turn red. He's sunbathing. And uh, I'm heading over to a local elementary school, and we're going to hunt the soccer field. Me and uh, Isman65, we're going to meet up today and hunt the soccer field. So when we get there, uh, I'll come back with you. Okay, so I'm here at the soccer fields. There they are. This man's down there hunting the soccer field. I'm gonna hunt this bank. It's uh, for people to sit. I found a, a zincan so far, and I got it in jewelry mode. I'm gonna didn't dig a lot of trash. I'm gonna see if I can find some jewelry today. So maybe we'll get back with you or something here in a minute. Well, the great thing about hunting in jewelry mode is, is you always find nickels. It's my second nickel I dug. So I normally don't dig nickel signals unless they're really strong. I mean, within two inches on top of the surface, I can find them on my pinpointer. But anyway, like I said, I found two today. I only really found like six this year, so still got this whole bank and all that down there to work. So we'll get back with you. Yeah, you know, I was going to tell you this place ain't old. It's built in the 80s, probably. But I just did. expect finding silver unless it's a piece of jewelry so get back with you all right guys I'm sorry for the wind noise uh, this thing is a lot of performance watch looks like but anyway I get home I'll uh, wash it up there and see what we got 1965 five quarter one more year like I say I don't expect to find any silver here today it's just a new school but Anyway, sorry about the wind noise. I probably won't take much because of the wind, so we'll get back with you. I think uh, his man found a .925 silver necklace, so I'll show you that here in a little bit. I found a little pocket spill here. It looks like I got a penny three dimes and another dime in there. All clad, of course, but that's kind of neat. I think that's the end of it. I was over there, but uh, for those trees, there's so much aluminum foil over there, it was going crazy. But I've been hunting this little area here, and it's mainly just coins. So we'll get back with you here with our finds, or let's find something good. You know what that is? Junk. All right, we're done hunting. It was just a short hunt. I got some junk, and my phone keeps going off, and uh, I got this junk watch, I guess. It says fossil on it. I'll wash it up when I get home. I think it's just junk. And uh, $2.09, five quarters, pennies, three nickels, some dimes, and uh, this man here, he's got, uh, let me say, dollar something, something, 40 something. $1.21 jump and uh, .925 uh, necklace here, the cross it says up here on the thing here it says uh, Italy on one side and then .925 so that's a neat little find that's uh, I guess that's your first silver of the year ain't it? Yeah. So alright guys, I mean, I'll get back with you I might do some more hunting here this week or something, might put this video on tonight or something, I don't know. Anyway, get back with you. No, I didn't drink too much wine last night and get drunk and run off the road. Actually, I come out here, my buddy's gonna give us a combine ride there and I was gonna videotape it. I seen him leaving with wagons while ago and there's his shit, but, oh yeah, tear up my Honda Civic. But uh, I don't see him, just brought that tractor out here, so I don't know where the hell he's at, so. I guess we ain't gonna have no, oh shit. I guess we ain't gonna have no combine video today. So, uh, looks like I'm gonna combine this field with my car. <laughs> so anyway, I thought I was gonna put this on there for you guys, but he ain't here and I got shit to do, so. Anyway, I might get back with you. Gonna have this plan for a while, but I don't know where the hell he's at. Man, I'll run over his house real quick. I got some shit I gotta do here in a little bit, so. 
I'll get back with you guys, maybe. I just got one corn stalk in there. <laughs> oh shit, I hope I didn't put a hole in my radiator. I did that one time on a pickup truck, driving in a cornfield and put a hole in my radiator, but anyway, back home. And uh, that just another failed attempt. I was gonna put this cab as a combine ride on there for you guys. But he wasn't there and I got stuff to do, so. Maybe if I catch him now, he's only got 23 acres of corn left to combine, so. Maybe if I catch him later tonight, I'll put, put a video on there. So happy hunting, everybody. Thanks for watching.